from Denver 7, this is 7 News. Still to come on 7 News this Saturday morning, we've got some tips on how to care for your landscaping throughout the course of the snowy winter months. Well, welcome back. Just because winter has arrived in Colorado doesn't mean you can really forget about your yard until spring. Joining us this morning with some tips on what to do with your yard right now and then especially kind of look into the future as well. Jocelyn Chilvers with the Associated Landscape Contractors of Colorado and we're going to talk a little bit about some of the maintenance issues but first you say this is a great time just to be thinking about what you want to do down the, down the road. Absolutely. Winter is a great time to get your ideas brewing and mm -hmm. contact your landscape professional to help you plan ahead so then when spring comes along everybody's ready to get on the project. Um, you can go to our website, ALCC.com, and click on Find a Professional. And we have 700 members in Colorado that can uh, tune in to your needs. And even if it's just a consultation to make right. sure you're on the right track, and also to get your project on schedule for springtime. So you right. aren't disappointed when you call in April and they say, oh, we're booked, we're booked for the yeah. whole season. Yeah, so this is really the time to kind of map everything out and plan. You said the big thing is fire pits. Yeah, that's probably the single hottest item I've seen uh, in the industry the last few years, and they're usually gas-powered, uh, so you can just click a switch, and this time of year, of course, it's great to get out in the early evening or even at night and fire up the grill and sit around the, the fire pit and enjoy your outdoor living space. All right, we've got some uh, pictures that show some of the possibilities and uh, some of the projects. Right, this there. is an example of a landscape plan done by one of our members, and it's a bird's eye view, literally a map of your property. And it will show the existing things you may have on site, like a great old tree uh, or a, a nice uh, shrub bed that you want to keep, and then the new enhancements. Um, and oftentimes, it's just a matter of really thinking about how your family is really going to use the outdoor space and making the most of your real estate. Uh, so whether it's a dining area or flower gardens or a bird feeding station outside your office window at home, uh, there's a lot we can, a lot of ideas we can help you with. Okay, so I know now is definitely not the time that you would actually be planting some of the plants that we're seeing in these photos right here, but can you do some of the other stuff, like maybe the pathways or now, and yeah. then do the plants later? Exactly. A lot of this work is, of course, weather-driven, right. but the hardscape, those elements of the landscape that aren't plants, can be worked on in the winter months, such as building a deck, building an arbor, uh, putting in a retaining wall, uh, cutting out lawn areas for new planting beds, mm -hmm. things like that. Okay, and very quickly, we, will, we all want to talk about with the cold weather, some things you should be doing to maintain what you already have. Absolutely. Don't forget the winter watering. Uh, wait for a string, a couple days of 40 degree weather, get out there and do a real good soak of those plant materials. Mm -hmm. um, and the other thing I wanted to mention is please don't use salt products as ice deterrents. Instead of grabbing the rock salt at the grocery store, get some kitty litter or go to your garden center for a no salt uh, snow and ice removal product. Okay, more environmentally friendly. And of course the website, we always talk about just how great it is. It's so interactive. and ALCC.com. Okay, very good. In fact, for more information, you can log on to the denverchannel.com. We've got that big red TV button there. You click on that, and it takes you to the link that gives you more information about your website as well. Great. Right. Thank Thanks, you. Jocelyn.